Hello everybody, back again. It's the next day. Uh, I turned this heat off last night on this and uh, I'm now back the next morning and I'm gonna do another filter again on this, see how we did. Like this. Okay, another filter. Some gold in there. Cup, funnel, filter. And this is gonna be uh, the second filter, same pieces. We'll just uh, do this again. We've got some more off of here. Let's see what comes out of this one. Yeah, there's still uh, still some fingers on there. Not all come off yet. Good. He's very close. Again, just water. Start rinsing this down a little bit. Dump it into our washout pan. Let's move this over here. Let that continue. In the meantime, dump everything out of here. Now, do not discard any of your chemicals. All that green stuff is copper. That can be retrieved as well. I'll do another video on that, on uh, getting copper out of the uh, acid peroxide solution. Uh, right now I'm just doing the gold and uh, start cleaning these off while that continues to drain. Now you can see that this gold has completely come off for now. Uh, both sides completely clean. It is now down to just the board. A few little spots here where it's stuck, but uh, no biggie. Just give a little scrape, a little scrape. It will come off. And then rinse it. Garbage. Again, board is completely cleared of all gold. Almost. Oh, there's some more here. And if you just scrape it, take the back of your fingernail and run along the ridges, it will come off. And then just rinse your fingers off. Even if you don't see it, it is still there. It will collect. When you drop it with the uh, uh, SMB, it will, uh, it will drop out of the liquid. So 
get everything in there that you can. There's a few fingers on there. Let's see if we can't get these to let go. No, not quite ready yet. They're actually stuck on there pretty good. So we will do what we've done before. Dry this off a little bit. Shut it down. You don't need the whole thing there, obviously. Gold is gone. Just trim that down. Back in our liquid. All the gold is off. Circles are completely bare. This is that board keyboard from the uh, cell phone. All the gold's gone. Gone. The rest of that ram stick is completely cleared. Trim pieces on the edge. Cleared. Tweezers for the small stuff. Empty. 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 Green stuff out of there. And still a few fingers on here. That side's clean. This side is not yet. I'll try and scrape this off. See, it's all over your fingers. All over the fingers. Just rinse that right back into the water. It will collect itself with the sodium made by sulfate or drop the gold. It will recollect it, so we'll just dry that off. Give it a little bit more time there in the solution. Now we have our second run. A little bit of gold there, plus what's in here. Finish running this out. Recycling this. Put this back in our jar. I'm using a mason jar. Anything, any type of mason jar, uh, jelly jar, anything that can take heat uh, will work. Pickle jars, anything like that. They've all been, uh, during processing, when they process the food, they heat the jars to uh, sanitize them. So they will stand up to heat on the uh, warmers. So you don't have to worry about that, about the glass breaking in that situation. Start rinsing this with water, rinse the sides down. Run this through as well. Put all that gold down in there. There we go. And rinse out our container. Let that run through. All right, we will let that settle. And uh, we'll be back with you shortly. Hey, everybody. All right, so it's been a couple more hours now. Got this all drained out, filtered. I'm going to rinse this off and get it into my jar with the rest of the, from the first run. Get all that together and ready to go. So I'll just stick this in here. So I got that off of the second run. Not too bad. Amount. Lots of fingers there. All right. All right. 
That's good. Got all the gold off of there. Now I will set up another filter just like before and filter this off. Filter. Cup. Flow again. Yeah, we'll get this going down here. through real quick. up. I'll start rinsing this out. Get every last little bit possible. Put this in my clean out bucket here real quick. These are the last two fingers that were pieces that left. Now this, you can see it's all cleared off completely. Nothing left. Just how we like it. Oh, one little spot there. Let's see if we can get this guy cleaned off of there. And that's it. That guy is completely clear. So it looks like we got everything off of there that we possibly could. Now what I like to do is run everything through again, out of this jar, out of this, back through the filter and get it all condensed with the smallest amount of water as possible. Okay. Now we'll let that cool off. This is still hot from being on the, on the warmer, and I'll let that cool off before I add it to the rest of my uh, leftovers, which I have here. Save it in a gallon container, save all that old solution, and when that fills up, I will uh, pull copper out of this. And I'll do another video on that. All of your solutions, always save all your solution, whether it's leftover uh, peroxide and uh, reactic acid, if it's leftover agua regia or reactic acid and bleach. This is uh, has dissolved gold in it from uh, previous videos. Save this. You can still get, uh, obviously, there's some copper in there. There's also silver, uh, possibly some palladium, platinum. So, save all that good stuff. All right. And different methods for all of that. I'll start rinsing this up a little bit. Get this guy in here. There's a couple of flakes in there floating around. Get those guys in there. Filter it out. Got some gold stuff down the side. Didn't even notice that. Huh. Okay. Get that guy in there. Alrighty. Hey. 
You can see this water still has a little bit of a blue tint to it. When it still has color, it still has chemicals. It needs to run completely clear. Like this. That's how you know you've got rid of all of your chemicals. Go ahead and dump this in here as well. Let it all filter and combine together. Rinse this guy out. Alright. Looks pretty good. Alright, we'll let this guy run down, filter out, and then uh, we'll continue with the next step.